Name one state that borders Canada. New York. Who is the commander in chief of the military? The president. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Cherokee. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. diplomat. Who was president during World War I? Woodward Wilson. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. Who makes federal laws? Congress. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Mississippi River. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Free the slaves. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of expression, freedom of speech. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Any citizen can vote 18 and older. 
Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote, join a political party. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. What does the president's cabinet do? Advises the president. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Joe Biden. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and the House of Representatives. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answers will vary. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Energy, Secretary of Education. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four hundred thirty-five. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. We elect a president for how many years? Four. Who signs bills to become laws? The president. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo te está yendo con el estudio de estas preguntas cívicas? Recuerda que si te gustaría tener un plan de trabajo para poderlas aprender mejor, tenemos un curso en nuestra página cursosconfernando.com. En este curso encontrarás un orden de trabajo sin interrupciones que podrás estudiar a tu propio ritmo y a tus propios tiempos sin importar tu nivel de inglés. Además, contarás con el apoyo de nuestro equipo ayudándote en tu preparación. Recuerda, esta página es cursosconfernando.com. Continuemos con la práctica. Mucha suerte. Who is the governor of your state now? Answers will vary. 
What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Civil War. In what month do we vote for president? November. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. Who was the first president? George Washington. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. When was the Constitution written? 1787. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Vote in a federal election. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15. 
Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War One. Name two national U.S. holidays. Independence Day, Tent Given. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Defend the constitutions and laws of the United States. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Free the slaves. What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 4, July 4, 1776. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. When must all men register for the selective service? At age 18. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because they have more people. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. How many U.S. Senators are there? 100. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty-seven. Who vetoes bills? The President. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there is one star for each state. There were 13 original states. Name three. New 
New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. Name your U.S. representative. Answers will vary. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announce our independence. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. What is the economic system in the United States? Market economy. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Mike Johnson. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? Native Americans. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. Si te gustaría informarte de cómo son las entrevistas en la oficina que a ti te corresponde, dónde tendrás tu entrevista, te invito a que nos sigas en nuestro segundo canal de YouTube, Citizens Ahora. En este segundo canal ponemos experiencias todos los días de diferentes partes del país. Puede ser que una de estas experiencias te dé información que tú necesitas para tu entrevista. Así que no olvides, síguenos en nuestro segundo canal de experiencias, Citizens Ahora.